with no new coronavirus cases recorded there for eight days. Matt Cunningham is in Darwin. Matt, we'd all like to be in the uh, Territory's position. That is a remarkable result. What's the government's reaction, though, to the push to start to ease off on those restrictions? Well, it's fair to say they're not keen on the idea, Ash. In fact, uh, the Health Minister, Natasha Files, has just made that pretty clear at a news conference that's just been held up here in Darwin. This push was coming from the Chamber of Commerce, Commerce in particular. They said that if there were no new cases for another three weeks, then the government should look at relaxing some of those restrictions uh, that are in place. Of course, uh, Darwin, the rest of the Northern Territory, is just like the rest of the country. Uh, bars and restaurants completely shut down, only open for takeaway. Those other restrictions... Uh, that we're seeing right across the country and many parts of the globes, uh, globe are also in place here. But it is true, Ash, that we have not had a new confirmed case uh, for some eight days now. There have been 28 confirmed cases in the Northern Territory, but more than a week since that last confirmed case. But here is the Health Minister, Natasha Files, uh, responding to those calls for uh, some relaxation of the restrictions. Now is not the time to lift the measures and now is not the time to talk about it and give that uh, false sense of hope. This is here for a long time. There is no cure. There is no vaccine for coronavirus. Uh, we have given our health professionals time to prepare our hospitals, but we mustn't become complacent. The Chief Minister has also said pretty consistently, Ash, that those restrictions will remain in place and are likely to remain in place for at least six months. It's also likely that those strict border closures will remain in place uh, as well. One uh, thing that will be a little bit different here in the Northern Territory will be the school situation. We're on school holidays at the moment, but as of Monday, school will return as normal. Parents have been told they can keep their children home if they contact schools and make alternative arrangements, but the expectation is that as of Monday, parents here in the Northern Territory will send their children to school.